Here's today's In Touch devotion. Today's scripture reading is Psalm 150. Praise the Lord. Praise God in His sanctuary. Praise Him in His mighty expanse. Praise Him for His mighty deeds. Praise Him according to His excellent greatness. Praise Him with trumpet sound. Praise Him with harp and lyre. Praise Him with tambourine and dancing. Praise Him with stringed instruments and flute. Praise Him with loud cymbals. Praise Him with resounding cymbals. Everything that has breath shall praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. The desire to give praise is hardwired in the human spirit. It's an impulse we can't ignore. And those of us who are Christians are called to direct that tendency to the one who made us. The Apostle Peter says it like this, You are a chosen people, a royal priesthood, a holy nation, a people for God's own possession, so that you may proclaim the excellencies of Him who has called you out of darkness into His marvelous light. It's a beautiful truth that we are God's own people, created, chosen, and called by Him to live a life of praise, both on our own and with other believers. In Psalm 34, David says, I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. However, he's not content to be a solo act. He exhorts other believers to join him. Exalt the Lord with me, and let's exalt his name together. So let's praise him at church on Sunday morning and on our front porches at sunset, when we start the workday, and each evening as we lie down to rest. Also, let's remember to praise Him not only for what He has done, but especially for the excellency of His character. God truly is worthy of our adoration. <music> 